Welcome to Real Physics. This is a series of short clips about constants of nature and today I will talk about the mass of the proton. Why considering constants at all? Because they are the key to fundamental physics. Most people would argue that the proton is not something we have to care about, not something we have to worry about, because there are so many particles in the standard model. But as I have argued in another video, things like quarks are very misleading concepts and the proton is the only massive stable particle and everything else besides the proton decays so I think if you look at fundamental properties the proton is something you have to consider. Now the mass is relatively easy to measure it's 1.67 times 10 to the minus 27 kilograms and you just put it into a magnetic field and it uh, will make a circular orbit you measure the radius and here's the mass. Most people again would argue that masses are not important, uh, they are just uh, parameters, but I would argue these are important messages of nature we have to care about. Also Einstein held this opinion as you might see from this quote. And what becomes really interesting if you compare the mass of the proton to the mass of the universe, that is determine the number of protons in the universe. It's about one, um, 10 to the 80 particles. And this again is related to other interesting coincidences. It's called Dirac's large numbers. So yeah, the general message, you know, is take these messages of nature. Uh, if you see coincidences, we need to explain this. And this is the way how we make progress in fundamental physics. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like it. And if you are interested in fundamental physics, subscribe to this channel.